This is News Tonight. Good evening, I'm Angela Lim. Here are tonight's top stories, with an eye on the announcements from the National Day Rally. A new classification of flats to be carved out as part of major moves in public housing to ensure affordability, a good social mix and fairness. Action is also being taken to offer more options for singles. Tiered support for older Singaporeans in meeting their retirement needs. An estimated $7 billion package will provide bonuses to CPF and Medisafe, benefiting some 1.4 million people. And reassurance by the Prime Minister that succession plans are back on track after pandemic disruptions. Mr Lee urging support for the 4G team as he stresses that recent controversies will not delay his timetable for renewal. A message of reassurance. Prime Minister Lee Sin Lung telling Singaporeans his government is committed to building a better home and a brighter future for them. It was a theme repeated across all three languages of his National Day rally. Mr Lee highlighted five aspects of life that his team is seeking to improve amid a landscape fraught with geopolitical tensions and economic uncertainties.